Ah, la vendeuse. Ah, donc oui, salut, là. On relance. D'autres vendeurs encore Parce que je t'avoue que... Attends... Je vais me capter que maintenant là mais... Marchand Ouais. Encore un marchand A 
Machina city, a thousand years old. They built the city on top of bridges across a river. But the weight of the city caused the bridges to collapse, and it all sank to the bottom. Right, it's a good lesson. A lesson? Yeah. Why build a city over a river, yeah? Uh, well, it would be convenient with all that water there. Nope, that's not why. They just wanted to prove they could defy the laws of nature. Hmm? I'm not so sure about that. Yevon has taught us. When humans have power, they seek to use it. If you don't stop them, they go too far, yeah? Yeah, but don't you use Machina too? Like the stadium and stuff, right? Yevon, it decides which Machina we may use and which we may not. So what kind of Machina may we not use then? Remember Operation Meehan? That kind. Or war will rage again. War? More than a thousand years ago, mankind waged war using Machina to kill. They kept building more and more powerful Machina. They made weapons so powerful, it was thought they could destroy the entire world. The people feared that Spira would be destroyed. But the war did not stop. Wh what happened then? Sin came, and it destroyed the cities and their Machina. The war ended, and our reward was sin. So, sin's our punishment for letting things get out of hand, eh? Man, that's rough. Yeah, it is. But it's not like the Machina are bad. Only as bad as their users. It's because of people like the Albed screwing everything up. Could that be? Sit down. Sorry! Ah! The outfit! Bon, là ça va être compliqué parce qu'on a que deux combattants. Donc technique, booster. Non, on l'a fait mal. mettre des trucs. Ah, J'avais bien raison, il fallait faire foudre. Ah dommage qu'il y a une casque que j'ai pas aussi. Je vois si je peux voler un truc. Ouais que des potions, on s'en fout quoi. Matti du sang. Je crois que je les ai trop entraînés là.
Putain, c'est le premier boss que j'ai violé. Normalement. Are you hurt? Uh, no, I'm fine. Oh. Oh. Those out bed. Is everybody okay? I I'm sorry, we're all okay now. Yuna. Uh. Super full speed ahead. Damn the out bed. What do they want from us? Have something to do with Luca? What do they have the uniform? Wait, they're mad they lost the tournament. Oh wait, they're mad about Operation Meehan. I wonder. Didn't Kamari's clansman say something about summoners disappearing? Ah, so the out better behind that. Those sand plastic grease monkeys. Hey, Waka. It's no use complaining about the owl bed now, right? We'll protect Yuna from anyone, anywhere. It's that easy. That's all I need to know. Well, I guess so. You're right. It's <laughs> probably <laughs> a tête en mode. Mais c'est simple, notre boulot, c'est la protéger C'est vrai qu'on est à côté de cette putain de ville. Et qu'on va bientôt pouvoir mieux les armes en fait. Et que aussi. Ta ta ta. Mais qui voilà You're not dead? Le boss était récou. But you attacked us. No, uh, it's not exactly what you think. Yo. Friend of yours. Uh, and you 
could say that. Pleased to meet ya. I'm Riku. Yuna, Lulu, I told you about her, remember? She was the one who helped me before I was washed up on Besaid. She's in our bed. <laughs> wow, so you like all your life. What luck meeting here, huh? Praise be to Yevon. So, uh, Riku, you look a little beat up. You okay? Uh, Waka. Huh? What? There's something we need to discuss. Oh, go ahead. Girls only. Boys, please wait over there. Right. Sorry, Waka. Huh? What? Ah. Là, t'es en mode. Mais what? Et euh. Il y a des trucs qu'on comprendra mieux, quoi. Sir Oren, I would like Riku to be my guardian. Tu es en train de dire what? Il lui a capté direct. Oh, ok. Open your eyes. As I thought. <laughs> Good? Are you certain? A hundred percent. So, anyway, can I? Attends, t'as dit C'est quoi ce recrutement? Yes, I do. <coughs> Riku's a good girl. She helped me a bunch. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm for it. The more the merrier. Right oh, then I'll just have to be the merriest. En plus, Waka, c'est le seul qui a pas capté que c'est Nabed. Waka had always hated the Albed. Riku, at your service. He never realized Riku was one of them. Bon. Vient le moment qu'on parle de farm. Bien le moment que la meilleure perso du jeu est là. Depuis quand Ah non, en fait, dans souvent. Parce qu'il y en a plein qui jurent sur Oron et Lulu. Mais Riku. Riku, c'est la veste. Voilà, on en parle sur l'attaque ultime. What did you just do? That was great. I can combine items and use them like this. It's not that tough, really. Ça c'est une attaque ultime. Ça c'est leur robot drive, ça. Déjà. Mais, du coup, quand on va avancer vers le chemin qui est Papier. Euh, non, tac, 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 tac. C'est. Pas requêté, mais c'est. Corruption. Ah, c'est où Attends. Il a pidé. Ok, tu claques ton argent. Mais tu peux faire des attaques de 9999 si ça grave de la thune. Ça, c'est que des détails. Bon, euh, tu me diras que Tidus peut le faire maintenant. J'ai la technique de voler. Mais euh. Ah bah putain, depuis, depuis qu'on est plus sur les routes de merde, euh... ça pop plus les monstres.
I'll do my best. Il y a ses coffres ici. Ah oh bah c'est bon, on peut les dégommer. Comment un poison c'est hyper cheaté quand même Marie, ça devrait passer avec lui. Oui, parce que attends, on va faire voler. Je sais que... Parce que, prenons l'exemple. Du coup, attaque souvent, mais si on fait ça, elle attaque presque tout le temps. Et encore, je n'ai pas amélioré sa vitesse. Ok, peut-être qu'on va pas trop XP ici. Ah bah là, on est déjà chez les gados. Mais, il y a des combats avec des coffres à voler. Faut qu'on vole le plus possible. Bon, on sait que les ennemis, ils ont rien d'intéressant à voler, donc... Donc, pute. Merci fort. You called? Yeah. Ah. En fait, dès que monte de niveau, faut que la level up parce que... Faut le faire. Elle a rien en PV. Donc voilà, pour l'instant, entraînement euh, obligatoire pour voler les coffres, parce que à chaque combat, il y a un point de coffre. Ou presque. <rire> Mais à la place du coffre, ici on a quelque chose d'intéressant qui s'appelle le flambeau. On va tester, est-ce que je le one shot comme ça Non. On est vraiment obligé de passer au stade bas, c'est plus quoi.
Je suis con. C'est là que j'hésite avec lui. Il va gagner autant de force de des côtés. Hein. Ouais, donc pas le choix de farmer. Euh... C'est possible. Hein. Pas le choix, je vais passer comme ça, du coup, le prochain, je suppose que c'est... Ah, même pas Donc, attends, reviens au run. Ah donc faut au moins level up le Riku quand même aussi, récupérer les objets. Parce que du coup Riku va venir très importante avec euh, l'utilisation des objets. Donc il faut que je farme euh, les blizzards, les bombos, les conneries, euh, les coffres. Et le meilleur endroit de farmer les coffres, bah c'est ici. Sauf que le taux d'apparition de monstres n'est pas ouf. Ouais bon j'ai compris dans ce couloir il n'y a pas de monstre. Je dois rester dans ce couloir. Toujours pas vie avec euh, Yuna, faut que je me dépêche. C'est quoi Si le prochain objet c'est pas où On avance. Pour faire, on n'y paye pas beaucoup ici. Hein. Là c'est plus du farm objet que d'XP. Hein. Ah bah ça change. Ooh. 
か Non J'ai pas fait gaffe Je suis en train de lui dire On attend le prochain coffre, le prochain forme de coffre, pour être sûr, c'est un truc de ouf. Faut continuer de fermer les coffres. Voilà pour quand tu fais quoi Imagine, tu utilises des objets avec les coups tout le temps. Parce que là, c'est la merde. Parce qu'elle est empoisonnée. pour euh, imaginer Oh bah vas-y, je trace comme ça.
Allez, encore des combats. Je veux des monstres. Attends. Je sais pas si j'ai monté de si PS. C'est cas des dragons quoi Because the best to see. C'est l'histoire que je sais pas si ça change quelque chose pour l'XP, mais voilà. Ah oh, vas-y, on va avancer. We have been expecting you, Lady Yuna. Welcome to Guado Salam. This way, my lady. This way. Uh, uh, me? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, I beg your pardon. I am called Trommel Guado. I am in the direct service of our leader, the great Seymour Guado. Lord Seymour has very important business with Lady Yuna. Business with me? Whatever could it be, I wonder? Please, come inside the manor. All will be explained. Of course, your friends are also welcome. Twist our arms, why don't you? Ah, I almost forgot. Plein de choses. Donc on peut améliorer l'équipement. Que 
care to hear. Pitties. Oh, how fare you, Sir Guardian? It seems that Maester Seymour, he's young. Alors, les auberges ça va rien puisque les sphères nous régénèrent. C'est vous qu'on... Ouais, je crois que c'est un marchand qu'on modifie. Ouais, on intéresse. Oui. Marchand, c'est l'argent. Ah si, c'est là, non, oui, ok. une histoire this way please Inform Lord Seymour. Please wait here. There's no temple here in Guadalajara, see? Summoners usually just pass through on their way elsewhere. <laughs> What? I didn't even ask a question, and you're explaining things. You'd rather I say nothing then? No, no. Maybe you finally believe I don't know anything about Spira. And maybe that means you believe me about Xanarkin, too? Well, there are many things I do not know. Your Xanarkin is one of those things. I suppose I can't say what I think either way. Still, be careful. You shouldn't tell other people. Yeah, I know. Stay on your guard. Why? This guy is just a priest, right? Those with power use that power. 
Maesters have power. Wait. You sure you don't have something against Yevon? <laughs> I lived a long time in Xanarkand. Ah. I get the feeling he called us. Bah, elle fait que bouffer. Sure know how to eat. Gee, I wonder what all this is for. It's ex Kimari not like Mr. Seymour. <gasps> what could it be? Oh. Again, since Lord Jiskel passed away, these halls have been too quiet. The death of Lord Jiskel was a great loss for all of Spira. Was this Maester Jiskel really such a great guy? He brought the teachings of Yevon to the Guado. He was truly a great man. Truly a loss for us all. Now, a new leader, Lord Seymour, has come before us. Lord Seymour is the child of a guado and a human. He will be the tie that binds our two races together. But that is not all, I think. Lord Seymour, he will surely become the shining star that lights the way for all the peoples of Spira. That is enough trouble. Must I always endure such praise? Welcome! You wanted to see me? Please, make yourselves at home. There's no rush. Please keep this short. Yuna must rush. Pardon me. It has been a long time since I had guests. Lady Yuna, this way. This sphere is a reconstruction created from the thoughts of the dead that wander the far. Xanarkand? Correct. Xanarkand, as it looked 1,000 years ago. and wondrous Machina city, Xanarkand. She once lived in this metropolis. <laughs> she who? She was the first person to defeat Sin and save the world from its ravages. And you have inherited her name. It was my father who named me. Lord Braska was entrusting you with a great task. He wanted you to face Sin as Lady Unaleska did. However, Lady Unaleska did not save the world alone to defeat the undefeatable Sin. It took an unbreakable bond of love, of the kind that binds two hearts for eternity.
Wow, your face is beat red. <laughs> you okay? He he asked me to marry him. You serious? Uh, hey. You know what Yuna must do. Of course. Lady Yuna. No, all summoners are charged with bringing peace to Spira. But this means more than just defeating sin. She must ease the suffering of all Spira. She must be a leader for the people. I proposed to Lady Yuna as a maester of Yevon. Spira is no playhouse. A moment's diversion may amuse an audience, but it changes nothing. Even so, the actors must play their parts. There's no need to answer right away. Please, think it over. We will do so then. We leave. Lady Yuna, I await your favorable reply. Why are you still here, sir? I beg your pardon. We Guado are keen to the scent of the far plane. Yuna, the High Summoner's daughter, Seymour, the leader of the Guado, married in the name of Yevon, overcoming the barriers of race. It would give Spira something cheery to talk about for a change. Sounds just like a passing daydream, like Oren says. Come on, let's just get on with the pilgrimage. I mean, marriage? Hmm, jealous? What? No way! We gotta defeat Sin. Romance can wait. You sure picked a fine time to lay this one on us. Maybe it is a fine time. You serious? If my getting married would help Spira, if it would make people happy, if I could do that for people, maybe I should do what I can. I never imagined doing anything like this, but I won't answer till I know what's right. Seriously? You could always just quit your pilgrimage and get married. <laughs> I will. Go on. I'm sure that Lord Seymour will understand. Um, I guess so. I am a summoner. I must fight and defeat sin. Like Braska before you. <laughs> I had to stop myself from shouting. What's there to think about? I'm going to the far plane. I'm going to see my father and think on this. Go on. We'll be right behind you. I wondered why none of the others ever asked Yuna. Do you love Seymour? Do you even like him? Yeah. Uh. About this far plane. When somebody dies, a summoner sends them to the far plane, right? So their souls, or whatever they are, uh, they go to the far plane, right? But that's the far plane we're going to, right? And Yuna's old man's there too? Do dead people live there or something? Hmm. You thinking those funny thoughts again, yeah? <laughs> yeah. <sighs> you 
We'll see once we get there. Aren't you coming? I do not belong there. <laughs> You're scared. Searching the past to find the future. This is all that is there. I need it not. You'd better be going. You're not really going to see the dead. More like your memories of them. People think of their relatives, and the Pyreflies react to them. They take on the form of the dead person. An illusion, nothing else. Hmm. Well, have fun. What? You're not going either, Riku? I keep my memories inside. Huh? Memories are nice, but that's all they are. Ah là là, quel gosse. C'est quand même un peu flippant ici. Hein. What the? Et magnifique à la fois. The far plane was cool. But I couldn't stop thinking about Yuna. Her parents, they look so happy together. But it got me worried that maybe seeing them would make Yuna really consider Seymour's proposal. Yo, Chapu! Meant to come see you earlier, yeah? Sorry, I know you won't hold it against me. Eh, I gave up that game. I'm a guardian from here on, you know? This guy looks a lot like you. Showed up. Traveling with him, I thought maybe you were still alive somewhere, yeah? But then again, here you are on the far plane. Guess your place is here. So, how you been? Oh, that guy I just told you about. I gave him a sword. He likes it. Huh? Wow. <coughs> he is dead, and I am still alive. Coming here really makes that clear. I should focus more on what I have to do now. <laughs> what? what? I'm not even sure what I'm saying. Don't you mean that you should leave Chapu behind? I'm sure he was a great guy, but don't be others. Hmm, that's a possibility. Hmm, how about mm, Waka? What, me with Waka? Yeah, you two get along great. Getting along isn't enough, not even close. Et pourtant. Oh, sorry, my mistake. Et pourtant, Awash. You'd do well to remember that. Knowing a bit about women might come in handy someday. Yeah, I'll remember. I won't be forgetting either. Goodbye, Chapu. You always said I looked grumpy. But those were the happiest days of my life. So, uh, Yuna? I've decided. Uh, oh, really? Uh, that's good. I remember. When I was only seven years old. In Bavel that day, my father had defeated Sin 
and the whole town was out in the streets. Everyone was laughing. They all seemed so happy. If I defeated Sin, that would make everyone happy, wouldn't it? I must do what everyone wants, not just what I want. Let's go back. You gotta tell Seymour. Before that, call Sir Jack. Give it a try. Huh? Don't worry. He won't come. Trying not to think about my old man made me think about him, of course. See, told you. He isn't here because he's not dead. He's sin. <laughs> that means he's alive, you know. What if my old man really is sin? What would I say to Yuna? Heck, uh, to everybody in Spira. Wait, why should I have to apologize for him anyway? I'd rather never see him again. What makes you hate him so? Everything he does just makes me mad. It was his fault that me and my mother... Uh... uh Mom? It's her? She's very pretty. But... Wait... No one ever performed the sending for her. She must have accepted death while she was still alive. Whoa there! That's my mother you're talking about. Oh, I I'm sorry. Hmm. It's okay. Uh, I think I just figured something out. What? Why I hate my old man. See, so, so I, I told, told him what I thought of him right there. What? Really? Of course. <laughs> I suppose, but. Mommy! Just, Just a, sec, a sec, dear. Whenever my old man was around, my mother wouldn't even look at me. Maybe that's when I started to resent him, even hate him. When he left us, Mom just lost her energy. Is she, she all right? right? Why, Why should you care? care? If she, she dies, dies, I wouldn't know what to do. Don't, Don't say, say Mom, Mom is gonna, gonna die. die. I apologize. The old lady next door told me, when a lovebird dies, the one left behind, it just gives up living so it can join its mate. It was just like that. I hated my old man even more. But what? really, my old man... Mommy! Just, just a sec, dear. Ah, go to him. He'll cry if you don't. Le seul qui remarquait que c'était comme son père. Sa mère s'en battait contre son fils. Le père, il disait. On va voir quand même. How embarrassing. Well, need some more time. No, I'm ready. Did I miss something? Thanks for waiting. I'll go give my answer to Maester Seymour. <gasps> Lord Jeskal! Oh, Lord Jeskal! Uh, he does not belong here. Why? Yuna, send him. Lord Jiskel no more. Send him now. <laughs> Talk later. We leave now. What was that just now? That really Lord Disco? I 
don't understand how a man like Lord Jiskel can die and not be sent. I would think that he was sent once, but he stayed on Spira. Something, a powerful emotion, could have bound him to this world. Such things happen. That's against the rules, isn't it? It means he died an unclean death. I will go meet with Maester Seymour. Yuna, Jisco is the Guado's problem, not yours. Um, what? So, Lulu, what do you think about Yuna getting married? As long as the pilgrimage continues, either way is fine. That's it? What if she doesn't even like the guy? Is that okay? People marry for many reasons. What's that mean? Sometimes marriage doesn't require love, you know? Defeat sin and bring joy to the people of Spira. Get married and bring joy to the people of Spira. For Yuna, they're just two ways down the same road. All you need? is determination. If you have that, you don't need love. I don't know. Mm, I just don't get it. gets married, then I... What? That again? Yes. If she is to marry, I would want her to marry for love. See? But, if Eunice said she wanted to marry the one she loves, I would have to object. Huh? Uh, you're not making much sense. I know. Oui, oui, tiens. Ça a pas de sens, mais quand tu sais ce que je sais... Voilà. We leave as soon as you... When we leave here, we have... Ah oui, le plan de foudroyer. Il est où qui m'arrive, là Qui m'arrive en dessous Où es-tu Tu vas accompagner Yuna Alors, je suis peut-être un baiser de la tête. My, was the lady Seymour not with you? No, she's at Seymour's place. C'est vrai. That's Maester Seymour or Lord Seymour. Oh, I'll be careful. Sorry. That's all right. Oh, Maester Seymour left Guado Salam a short while ago. You serious? I believe he went to the temple in Makalania. Maester Seymour is also the high priest of that temple. Whoa, I gotta tell the others. Seymour went to Macarena Temple. 
Makalania Temple. I? What I don't get is, why would the Lord Maester head off without a peep to anyone? Maybe he wasn't expecting Yuna's answer so soon. Ah, that's probably it. <laughs> Yuna, what is it? Oh, nothing. Hmm. You're a poor liar. It's true, it's nothing. Come on, let's go. Parti pour la plaine foudroyée.